everyone will have different reasons for getting into biodiesel. You kind of have to ask yourself, why not? The technology is there. Uh, we have resources out there that we can do this. It's easy to do. And you look at the global economy and look at everything. This is the start. This is in 10, 15 years. This is what everyone's going to be used to. So why not start? We're making biodiesel from uh, the used casino oil. On top of that, we threw in a couple of five-ton seed presses. To date, we've, we've made 3,000 gallons from the, used, uh, from the casino oil. That's a yearly production. But all told, we've done 12,000 gallons since 2009 with the various seed crop oils included. We're in a farming community where we have seed crops readily available. We can make biodiesel out of any different feedstock that we choose. We support local farmers and we employ local people. The diesel is, stays here and is burnt here. Is it easy? I mean, if I can do it, anyone can do it. Springboard has really set it up um, to where they, they've already thought of everything. I put the oil in and presto, out comes the diesel. We don't have to convert any of our equipment. It just straight on uh, biodiesel runs in any diesel rig without any conversion factor at all. So really our bottom line around here is can we make it uh, reasonably priced? And we can. And it's nice for the environment. Again, that's icing on the cake. Our ultimate vision for the tribe is we're large farmers and we burn over 100,000 gallons of fuel to produce enough fuel for everything in-house. So we'd be over 100, probably 150,000 gallons of biodiesel a year. That's our goal.